got out of the ortho. I have we only need the two of us together. I need only you in this crazy world. Cause we got love, love. I need only you here with me. You wanna get close to me? Why don't you do it right now? You know we met Good morning. We're in front of the ortho, waiting to go in. We have to wait in our car, which is fine with me. I'd rather wait in here than wait in a waiting room. Anyway, I'll let you know how it goes when I get out. Happy, was it Wednesday? Happy Wednesday. <sighs> it's a nice sunny day. It's a nice sunny day. Thank God. Anyway, talk to you later. Alright, so got out of the ortho. I have lots of calcification in my shoulder. Um, he gave me a cortisone shot right where the calcification is and that hurt so bad. It was like, it was probably the most painful shot I've ever gotten in my life. I'm 45 years old. I didn't think I'd ever say that. I've gotten some shots. I've even had cortisone shots before in my foot or ankle, whatever. It never felt like this. This was fucking terrible. And then I moved and I ruined it even more because he had to he had to stay in there and keep injecting whatever was in that. It hurt. Um, I, have a, I have like a follow-up in two weeks to make sure like everything's checking out. I got exercises that I have to do every day, five times a day, different types of things, arm up the wall, Swinging in circular motion. There's lots. Um, yeah, so that's what's going on. If you're curious, I'm just out. Oh my god, I really like them there though. So I guess I found an orthopedic, which is nice because I've never had an orthopedic before. But it's good to have somebody, you know. Now Arlo can go there if she's having issues too because. She was with me and she's seen, they're cool, cool people. Nice office. Anyway, we're at Wawa. <clears throat> I'm gonna get a buy, which is the drinks that I like, and I'm gonna get a coffee and we're gonna go to my mom's. Kinda just give them a rundown of what just happened and then we're gonna run home. Uh, my arm's still not working very good. I just dropped my phone. Um, yeah, so, that's what's going on. Uh, we'll vlog later. When we get home. Austin has work at four, so I don't know what we're eating for dinner. I have a I have this insane uh I feel like I want coconut shrimp. Your coconut shrimp or my coconut shrimp? I don't when do you make coconut shrimp? Coconut milk. The I don't want that. That's not what I want. I want coconut fried coconut shrimp like uh, that. Okay. Anyway. Oh I gotta Uh hi. We just went to Jersey Mike's. We got Austin a sub. He's got work at four. We just got him a regular Jersey Mike's uh, number seven, which is turkey and provolone. So good. With mayo and shredded lettuce. Oy. I got a... He's basic. He's basic as fuck. Um, I got a wheat wrap, Mike's Way, number seven. I love turkey. Can you guys tell? And Arlo loves roast beef, so she got herself a number six. The pinker, the better. Oh, Lord. The pinker, the better. Um, we haven't had Jersey Mike's in a, it's been a while. Um, so we got ourselves a little treat treat. I'm making some coconut trim tonight. We're gonna have Emily Mariko's on TikTok's uh, salmon bowl. Again. Again. Now, Dana's had it. This is her, our like fourth time having it. And I don't, I don't eat salmon. Like I like it in sushi. But if, if Dana wants or has something more than once, more than twice, actually more than three times, you know, you know it's, it's good. good. Like, if you see me eat something once and I'm like, oh, this is good, but then you never see it again. It was good, but not good enough to have again. Yeah, but you, I've had this now a couple of times and it's absolutely delicious. So we're having that. Um, so that's exciting. And like I said, I'm gonna make some coconut shrimp. Um, there was something else did I wanted to say. Did you shoulder? Yeah. I have a, uh, I did, I, t I told them, I'm okay. not gonna repeat myself. Cause I don't have to edit that out. So we got that, we're gonna go have some lunch. 
and went over to my mom's just to like let them know what was happening with my shoulder, seeing my brother, it was nice. And then, Austin well, has work at four. I'm gonna drop him off, get some gas, and that's it. It's been, it's been a good day so far because I'm happy I went to the doctor. Yeah. Yeah. Your mind's more at ease now. It sure is, because I was absolutely stressed out. You. Anyway. Oh, and we went to ShopRite. Uh, we just picked up like some veggies and shit like that. Got a couple of like bag fries, things like that. You'll see it when we get home. Um, oh, it's sunny. So, see you when we get there. All right, let me show you what we got from ShopRite. It's small as you see, but it's fine. Uh, we got avocado. I got two avocados. I got some melatonin because my ass has a lot of trouble sleeping. Um, and then I got these. They're gummies. Mood, stress and mood boosters. This is for Sam. She loves this. Um, these are for Austin and Sammy too. These are the cheddar cheese Purdue nuggets. They're so good. I got that. Some fries. Some raviolis. The little mini raviolis. Some white corn. Uh, I got strawberries for my shakes. Um... Tuna, this is strictly mine because I like the solid white. I will not eat that light shit. I found these because I somebody that I know on TikTok, she was eating, um, what do you call it? Tacos, like soft shell tacos. And we really like the Ezekiel bread. I really like it, the sprouted situation. It's just better for you. So I got these. I didn't even know they made tortillas. This is for tonight. We're having Emily Marie. Emily Mariko's salmon bowl situation again. I'm having mine with collie rice though this time. Arlo have hers with a little bit of white rice, jasmine rice. Arlo went buck wild on these things because she loves them. These are the breaded green. Oh, I do. Actually, Austin likes them too, so let's just be real. Um, green beans, they're breaded green beans from bird's eye. Romaine lettuce for everybody. I got some hummus finally. I've been craving hummus with my cucumbers in there for forever. So I got some garlic and regular white turnips, milk for the kids, dill and parsley for the piggies. And that's it. That is all. Empty bags. I would like to say that we just got gas from Costco and Arlo did not take out any type of stationery or anything. Do you guys remember? You if you a true OG on here, you will remember all Tell me, tell me what I used to do. Yeah, let, let, let's see if you guys answer correctly. What did Arlo used to do at the gas station? Go ahead. In the comments, I want to know. All right, so... Let me just tell you, Dana's feeling a lot better. She knows she's got to rest it, she's got to ice it, but she's feeling good. Yes. And we all know that she should. You're stupid. Oh my God. You, you guys know I'm already Please. corny. I'm, I'm, I'm corny. You guys are already know this. Ew. But I have some salmon skin in the air fryer. Dana will not do anything with that. She does not Ew, want anything to do with that at all whatsoever. So, um, let me show you what we have on the table already. Okay, so uh, there's my bowl of rice with some salmon, seaweed. I actually opened up the other one. See, there it is. Um, we split it in half. There's Dana's with her coconut shrimp. And there's her salmon with the cauliflower rice. There you go. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And then our... Uh, Sriracha, QP mayo, light soy, and do we have anything else? No, that's it. No, that's it. Good morning. Um, Dana can tell you how she's been feeling um, since last night, tonight, today. Anyway, I've got breakfast. I just put stuff on the uh, computer, so there'll be a vlog for you guys soon. You guys would have already seen it before you see this. You know what I mean. Let me just show you breakfast. There we go. Two slices of uh, cinnamon raisin uh, Ezekiel toast. 
white turnip hash. It's got some uh, white turnips. Duh. Some peppers and onions. Yep. Yes. And then I've got scrambled eggs. And then a couple pieces of center cut bacon. Doesn't that look delicious? You guys already know what Danish cooking looks like. I'm sure you don't know what it tastes like, but you know what it looks like. All right, so here's my breakfast. I have basically this, no, actually I don't. But I've got the turnips, which are the home fries. And I like potatoes too, I mean, I eat potatoes too, but I do like the turnips. Um, the bacon, center cut bacon, egg whites with a um, half a slice of cheese. And then I've got mushrooms and this is, I want it savory, I didn't want sweet today. So this is a Dave's Killer Bread English muffin. I'm gonna put some of that on there and I'm drinking water and finishing up a protein shake. Good Friday morning. How the hell are ya? We just got back from bringing Austin to work. We went to Costco to get some veggies and um, drinks. And Arlo's about to put up a vlog today. We stopped at Target to get a coffee. Americano. Um, oh, and I have a turkey here that I seasoned yesterday up. It's a big turkey breast. I'm gonna put this in the oven and we're gonna have this for dinner tonight with some veggies and a salad and it's gonna be delicious. So that's what's going on there. Um, I got these, let me show you what I got. I mean, we'll start off with these. We got these for, Arlo can have some too obviously, but these have turned out to be one of my favorite drinks ever. They're amazing. I love them so much. I've always seen them in the store. I'm like, eh, eh, but Here's the thing with them. So they're 10 calories for the whole bottle, right? And they're 12 total carbs, right? One sugar, but it's made with erythritol, which is 10 grams. So you do the math. It's only two net carbs for one bottle. And these are so good. They're antioxidant infusion and they're just delicious. Anyway, I'm gonna take out what's in, it's just what's in that bag right there. Can you see that? And then I'll show you. So like I said, you've seen these. Um, this was seven, seven fifty nine. This big old thing of cookie dough. So if if your kids are anything like the way I was when I was a kid, or anything like the way my kids are these days, like well, not these days, just in general, the kids love when I make cookies, but they also like to eat the raw cookie dough. I mean, who doesn't? I used to always want it when I was a kid. So I just got a big thing of this. They know that not to sit there and eat it unless they ask, but. I'm going to make some cookies with it today and then they can have cookie dough, you know, in their ice cream sometime in the weekend. Uh, we got some broccoli, some Brussels sprouts. We needed salt. We got the Himalayan salt, some heavy whipping cream, um, fresh mushrooms. I got my tuna and that's it. We got the kids, uh, the Kirkland sparkling flavored water thing. It's kind of like those ice, the ice brands, but it's cheaper. I mean, it was seven. $7.49 for like, there's a ton of bottles. So yeah, anyway. Mm -hmm. If you wanna know how I'm feeling, I'm feeling good. And that's a good thing. But I do need to go take my medicine. I just remembered that. It's just naproxen, but I need to take it. Anyway, so that's what, what, what's happening. You see it right there? It's the Kirkland sparkling, whatever the fuck it is. They love it. Anywho, so I'm going to make us some breakfast and then after breakfast, I'm going to feed the piggies and then go outside and start stringing some lights like on the porch and we have these little blow up things um, to put, they're like four foot ones. They're not like the real big ones because those things never stay up properly because of the wind. But um, so that's, that's what's happening here. That is what's happening here. Today's just gonna be chill, 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 chill. Um, let me get the corn muffin mix out. So I'm just making the jiffy. There it is. I'm gonna add some honey and some sour cream and it's gonna be delicioso. So there's three servings in here. Really, three servings. So how many can you get? Oh, it makes, oh, okay now. So two, two corn muffins is a serving. So this makes six. And there are three servings in here, which you can have two corn muffins. I'm probably only gonna have one though, which cuts that right in half. 
and we'll, we'll have some eggs and bacon. That center cut bacon from Costco, no, Target, mmm, so good. All right, so this is what is for, I'm guessing it's lunch. Yeah, it's almost one o'clock already, shit. So just uh, one Jiffy corn muffin. So here's how I made this a little less calorie dense. Um, my mom used sour cream, I did not. I used low, uh, low fat uh, Greek yogurt, plain Greek yogurt, same difference, truthfully, it's just more protein. Um, a little, a little bit of butter, and then I put a tablespoon of honey in the mix to give it some sweetness. And I used egg whites instead of using one whole egg. We've got a egg white omelet with one egg included in there, and then some bacon. That got a little fucking dark. And one of those. And that is our food. Alright, so Dana's got a turkey in the oven. She's had a turkey in the oven since after lunch. We're just waiting to leave so we can pick up Austin. Then it was just hanging out, chilling, and I was writing out some of our Christmas cards. Hold on. There's only a few of them. I still have a bunch to go. Here's my list. Some of the cards that we've gotten and address labels. It's one less thing for me to write. I still have... Yep. It says 5%. All right. So we just got home from picking up Austin and he had a long day. Okay. So me and Dan are having one of these. Thanks, Frank. A bang mix. Thank you, Frank. Hard seltzer, 5% alcohol, caffeine free. This it one is. Taste like it has 5% alcohol. Purple Kittles. Dana has got the uh, Pina Colada. Yep. No, not sponsored. No, not sponsored. So, I don't know what purple kittles Mine are supposed to, like supposed to taste like. I'm not a fan of... It's funny because I like coconut milk, but I'm not a fan of pina colada. Pina colada. Pina colada. I don't know if it's grape or berry. Alright, so Smell. I'm going to start making the side dishes now. That's why the kids can eat. It's like Pretty Skittles. Much. You like it? It's like Skittles with alcohol. Taste. No, I'm busy right now. I'm busy. You don't see me busy over here? No, I don't see you busy over here because I'm looking at them right now. But this is pretty good. It is good. Mine is good. Mine actually tastes like a pina colada. Mmm. 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 There you go. Alright, so here's dinner. Salad with a uh, homemade ranch. We have these um, cauliflower bites, garlic parmesan, something, something like that. It was a uh, bird's eye. And then the uh, turkey breast that Dana made today. Dinner. Good morning. Ooh, I just got back from a three mile walk. I try to do three miles. I used to do like two or a little over, but now I strive for three because I know the route that I take is exactly three. So I do three. Um, I woke up at like seven this morning, which was nice. Nice, nice, nice. I'm going to make us uh, some protein shakes, but like smoothie-like. Oh, now my phone is ringing. Hold, please. Anyway, here we are. Um, that was my mom. Um, anyway, so I'm going to make smoothie, smoothie like protein shakes. Uh, I'm actually going to put my banana inside my smoothie this time around because uh, these bananas are getting kind of dark looking. So that's, mm! these are looking kind of ugly and I don't do bananas that look like this. I can't eat them like that. They're too sweet for me, but I can have them in a shake and that I like. So I'm going to put, I'm going to use unsweetened coconut milk, which is here. And look, I got that shirt on. Do you guys know in the beginning of the vlog? Look at this. Look at all the room in this shirt. This shirt used to be tight on me, people. So there's that. If you ever think you haven't made progress, put a shirt on that you used to wear and put it on now. You've made, you've made lots of progress. Um, so, yeah. 
going to make that. And Arlo ordered some new protein uh, powders. She ordered the Quest ones, which I do like a lot. So we got the vanilla milkshake, which I think I'm going to do today, and the chocolate milkshake, which I'll do tomorrow. I want to have them both open so I have options. And then she's going to do this nasty fucking cookies and cream because it's fucking disgusting. I cannot... I cannot get down with it. It is just not for me. I don't, I, I can't do it. So she's gonna have that, and I'm gonna have this, and we're gonna do this. And then we're gonna have some lunch later, just some hot dogs, bun on and bun off, and then turkey, sweet potato, broccoli tonight for dinner. And that's, that's, that's what happened then. I'm actually gonna have turkey, sweet potato, broccoli, tomorrow night for dinner tonight i'm gonna have what i made the other night which was a chicken and pepper um truffle stir fry situation and i threw it on top of a shit ton of lettuce and tomato i'm gonna have that tonight because then i don't have to make anything for tomorrow because i'll already you know have something for tomorrow and she's having that pork belly blood shit so yes so I made some brown gravy for the turkey. For some reason, the, the package that the, it, the turkey came with like a gravy packet situation that, that you add the drippings to and no, it didn't taste good at all. It wasn't good at all actually. And I did add some drippings to it. So it's not like I, it, it just wasn't good. So I just made some like regular brown gravy just now so that they can uh, put that on their turkey. There it is right there. So we'll let that cool. And I am making onions here. I will add a little bit of ketchup to that. And we'll have some like hot dog onions. We've got the hot dogs going on in the back over there. Um, there is a tablespoon and a half of palmetto cheese, which is not very much, but it's for her. Um, so she'll have that with chili, which is in here. There are four tablespoons of chili in this little container here. One each for, we're having two hot dogs a piece, so four hot dogs. And then I'm having sauerkraut, because that's how I roll with mine. And that's it. I'm going to have a little bit of hummus and cucumber on the side. I want something like that. So, that's, that's what's happening here. Yeah. We're going to see what the weather brings today. I don't know. It's not very nice. It's very doomy and gloomy out. So, I don't really know if I'm going to be doing what I wanted to do yesterday today. Because it's not nice out. And I feel like it might fucking rain. I don't want to be out there in the rain with lights. We'll see what happens. I'm going to have to fucking do it tomorrow. I don't know. There I am. Can you see me? I'm going to go warm up the cheese in the microwave for 15 seconds and then assemble this situation. And like I said, we're having the 647 uh, hot dog buns. We're just having one with and one without. Just, you know, they're good though. If you've never tried them, I would try them if I were you because they're very good. This is not Jeopardy, but this is lunch. Anyway, you guys have seen this. Well, I think on the previous vlog, you've seen what this was about. So this is our lunch. All right, so I found our tree skirt because I we didn't have it under there. We had something else under there. So I put our tree skirt under there, which I'm excited for. Oh, and hi, I've been busy all day. Um, I put that up there. I found that. I found a lot of things in the garage that um, I forgot we had. So I wanted to show you what I found. Um, that snowman, that snowman, I forgot that we had these. That little thing under there, it's so cute, it's like a little village. And then my cute little red trucks, red trucks, you. And then, let me show you. <gasps> that, oh my god, I forgot I had that. You guys have seen this tree. But, I wanted to show you in here, I've got my red trucks on my bed so this is a like a little throw but it fits the whole bed and then a friend of ours on ye, um on instagram her name is lauren she actually gifted us a red truck queen sheet set so i put it on today and it's so pretty so soft i love it and of course chloe's laying on the bed because she couldn't resist anyway so 
here I am. I've been busy, very, very busy. I, oh, and I put our stockings, there they are. I put those up and then I put all of the piggies, except for Raymond, we have to piggy, piggy, piggy. <laughs> anyway, um, I just had dinner. I had a huge salad with chicken breasts, peppers, onions. Um, it was marinated in truffle oil. Can you see me? It was marinated in truffle oil for like a day. And then I just threw it on a shit ton of lettuce, tomato, cucumber, and I used, let me show you. I used this dressing because it's super low in calorie. The Bolt House um, avocado cilantro, whatever that one is. It's, what is it? 40, for two tablespoons, 40 calories. I mean, for salad dressing, you ain't finding that anywhere. Salad dressing is like 150 calories for two tablespoons. A lot of them are very, very calorie dense. Um, but I was outside and I put some lights up like on the porch and on the railing and I put a couple of little blow up things up and um, I just put some decorations up outside that I was wanting to do but I didn't have a chance because I was hurt. So I did it today but there is two more things that need to be put up. Arlo's going to do it tomorrow and that's it. I've just been a busy bee. I cleaned here. I washed all the blankets on the chairs because, you know, the animals sit on there. And uh, so now I'm going to put them back on the chairs. Yeah, because this is the way our chairs look without the blankets, like, on the actual chair. Like, I usually have a blanket that covers this whole recliner. And then there's blankets that cover the bottom of that, like where you sit, because dogs, cats, yeah. I don't want my shit getting screwed up, so let me go get that out of the dryer. But I've been busy. I've been busy, busy. I even have something in the window there. It's a red truck. You can't see it, but when you're outside, you can. I've just been a busy bee, and I'm, I'm happy because now I don't have to do it tomorrow. I just had one of these buys. This is the blueberry one. So freaking good. And that's it. I've just... I did Georgie's litter box and I cleaned our bathroom like you know like the toilet bowl and the sink and all of that I did all that Austin's working Sammy's upstairs with me and Arlo is working so I know it's dark but I'm probably just gonna check you guys tomorrow see you manana and uh toodles Good Sunday morning. Um, I'm a busy bee today. I was a busy bee last night. I've got two chicken thighs here that I have. Um, I used lemon pepper, garlic powder, onion powder, paprika, and some Himalayan pink salt with some olive oil. And I rubbed it all over underneath the skin, uh, on the skin, underneath, everywhere. It's going to sit for a little while. Then I'm going to make a concoction of soy sauce, a little bit of honey, and some garlic. And then that's going to be like my little base that I'm going to baste this with in the oven. So Arlo's having this with some sautéed cabbage. I did not take a walk this morning because I have a lot to do today. And I want to do a, an actual video, like an exercise video. So we're going to do that instead today. Um... And it's fucking freezing outside, which that doesn't normally stop me from walking. But today I've got a lot to do. So I kind of want to get that done before anything else. Um, Arlo went to go drop Austin off at work. He has a 9.45 shift today till 4. And then she's going to go to Wawa, pick up some coffee for herself and get me one as well. And yeah, that's it. I'm making the kids chicken parmesan tonight with long spaghetti. Um, right here. And garlic bread. And I am going to be having some sauteed cabbage. I was going to say spinach. Sauteed cabbage. And I don't know. Maybe a vegetable of some sort. Even though that is a vegetable, I want another vegetable. So yeah. I'm making homemade shrimp burgers for lunch today for myself. I'm making Arlo turkey salad. Um, as you would have chicken salad, I'm making her turkey salad with the leftover turkey breast. She'll have that on a wrap. And um, I'm making, like I said, homemade shrimp burgers. If you've ever had the ones from Trader Joe's, 
I make them homemade and they're so good. So I gotta take out my green onion, uh, I gotta take out some shrimp, defrost it, and then put it in the food processor with all the goods and make some shrimp burgers. And um, I'll probably have that with some hummus and mm, hummus and cucumber. Yeah, I'm tired. I did a lot yesterday and I'm feeling it now. Uh, so I've got some chicken just defrosting there. That's just chicken breast. That'll be for me. And then the kids will have, like I said, chicken parm. And I'm thinking about making like a pepperoni chicken. Um, don't ask me how. I'll have to figure that out. But um, you'll see it when I show it to you later. But I'm going to go get some shrimp out of the freezer in the garage. And then I'm going to defrost that and get moving. I'm, I've got guinea pigs cages to clean today, which is like a fucking hour and a half process. So there's just not enough time in the day to do things sometimes. And as much as I do want to take a nice long walk, I don't have the time. So I will get my movement in today with just moving. So, and sometimes that's a lot too. So yesterday I finished out with almost 20,000 steps or it might've been 20,000. Um, but let me put my watch on now that just reminded me and that's all. That's all, folks, in my water. Mm. I showed you guys my, look at the red trucks. Ugh. So, got lots to do today. Let me get going. I will show you the progress as it unfolds. All right, there is Arlo's uh, chicken thighs. These are um, honey garlic chicken thighs. So I'm gonna let those chill for a few minutes and then I will add them to She's having sauteed cabbage with just a tablespoon and a half of butter salt pepper garlic powder onion powder power powder the usual suspects um, I made my shrimp burgers There they are. They're flash freezing right now. I'm gonna throw them in the air fryer once they get a little like firm It's just shrimp Green onion, red onion, fresh ginger, salt, pepper, garlic powder, onion powder, um, some celery, egg white, and two tablespoons of ground up pork rinds. Just a, like a binding situation. I will make those on some lettuce, like a lettuce wrap. So let me uh, do the thing here. All right, here are the shrimp burgers. I put them in the air fryer. There's a half a slice of cheese on each some hummus and some cucumber with everything but the bagel seasoning. It looks so good. 